is an automated external defibrillator used for victims suffering a sudden cardiac arrest. There are many of them placed out in public arenas now and I'll just give you a demonstration. Begin by removing all clothing from the patient's chest. Cut clothing if needed. When patient's chest is bare, remove protective cover, take out white adhesive pads. Look carefully at the pictures on the white adhesive pads. Peel one pad from the yellow plastic liner. The pads actually show you where place to place exactly them exactly. As shown in the picture. Press firmly to patient's bare skin. When the first pad is in place, look carefully at the picture on the second pad. Peel the second pad from the yellow. No one should touch the patient. You ensure no one's touching analyzing. the casualty? It's analysing what the heart rhythm's doing. No one should touch the patient. Analyzing. Shock advised. Stay clear of patient. Press the flashing orange button now. Shock delivered. So you've defibrillated them? Be sure the ambulance service has been called. It is safe to touch the patient. Start CPR. For help with CPR, press the flashing blue button. Place the heel of one hand in the center of the chest between the nipples. Place your other hand on top of the first. Push the chest down firmly five centimeters. Keep time with the beat. and give two full breaths. Breathe. Breathe. Continue with compression. And you continue doing the compressions or following the prompts on the machine until the ambulance arrives. You do not take the pads off because it analyzes. Sometimes they may flick back into what we call ventricular fibrillation and it will tell you to stand clear and press the flashing orange button again. For more information on defibrillators, you can go to stjohn.org.au or give us a call on 1300 360 455.